received word from our Federation intelligence that the Beast of Harmala is planning an attack on planet Dragos very soon. We cannot get our battle fleet there in time so we must find a way to help them fight his fleet until we can get there. Let us search the archives for some way. Yes they are an unarmed member of the Federation so they have no defense. There must be a way to do so. Good we have found a solution. This planet called Earth has produced nuclear weapons that could be used by the Dragazi. They must offer them membership into the Federation in return for their assistance if we all agree. Athes is the only way as they cannot defend themselves as an unarmed member. The humans have much to learn. It is time they joined us. Excellent, we are all in agreement. Contact the Dragazi Council and advise them. We will send our battleships as quickly as possible to Dragos but in the meantime they must defend themselves. Prepare a special welcome to our new members when this is over with. They have much to learn and we must prepare them. According to the records they are still warring amongst themselves. The Federation has approved for us to grant them membership into the Federation Alliance in return for their nuclear weapons. Our fleet will depart immediately for Earth. Commander Azumak has been authorized to present the offer to the human leaders. Once we have acquired the weapons we will be able to defend ourselves against the Beast of Harmala and his droid fleet and the Federation are sending battleships as quickly as possible. In the meantime we must try to protect our citizens the best we can. The Federation has approved for us to grant them membership into the Federation Alliance in return for their nuclear weapons. Our fleet will depart immediately for Earth. Commander Azumak has been authorized to present the offer to the human leaders. Once we have acquired the weapons we will be able to defend ourselves against the Beast of Harmala and his droid fleet and the Federation are sending battleships as quickly as possible. In the meantime we must try to protect our citizens the best we can. Our Dragazi fleet is ready for departure, sir. The jump gate has been activated. Good I want all of you to remember that the humans will be shocked and scared on our arrival so we need to make a pre-arrival contact with their leaders to announce our intentions and arrival. Our fleet will separate on arrival and maintain a position over all major cities on earth to pick up the leaders and escort them to my ship. Commander Azumak will be meeting with the leaders on board. Enter the jump gate. Dragazi fleet are headed for Earth to obtain nuclear weapons to use against you. Well, we must intercept them, no, no, we will go to Earth and destroy them all at one time. The humans have nothing that can stop us that won't kill all of them too. Then I will destroy the Federation and the universe is mine. As you wish, the Federation fleets are not expecting that so you will succeed. Proceed to Earth and prepare for immediate battle.
it is time to do battle. We have taken them all by total surprise. Launch the first wave of droid fighters to take out the Earth airships and use the ship lasers to blast the Dragazi mothership with all of the world leaders on board then we will destroy all of their bases. With their air forces and leaders out of the way the humans will not be any problem. They will be confused and in total horror at the onslaught and run to hide. This just in, we have received word that the president has issued a statement that he will be making an emergency address to the nation in two hours. There is no official explanation from the White House as to the subject of the announcement. However, there have been unofficial reports coming into the news center that a fleet of UFOs is currently in orbit of Earth and that they have requested a meeting with all of the world leaders. That is unverified at this time. Please stay tuned for more- Attention all humans on Earth, we come in peace and mean you no harm. We have come to meet with your world leaders. We have made contact with them and will be meeting with them all very soon aboard our mothership in orbit of your planet. There is nothing to fear. An announcement will be made by your leaders after the meeting to inform you of the results. We are the Dragozi species from your own Milky Way galaxy. We are members of the Universe Federation Alliance. We are an unarmed fleet. There is nothing to fear by our sudden arrival so please remain calm and await your leaders' statements. We understand your concerns and are here to help you. Okay, well that's big news. We do have confirmation that aliens have arrived and that they claim to be peaceful. Yes and we can only hope that all goes well. We will be right back after this break so stay tuned for more. We will be keeping you informed on all events. I would like to say that it is true that alien spaceships have arrived and are in orbit of Earth. The President and all world leaders have been invited aboard for peaceful communications. There is nothing to worry about. Be calm and wait for the President to return and advise us of the situation. We have lost all contact with the alien mothership and it was observed being destroyed by another alien race. That alien race has declared war on us. You must go to shelters now as they are moving battleships to the major cities. Go to shelter immediately or take cover. Do not go outside if you are in a major city. Find a quick shelter and try to remain calm. Our air forces are battling the alien force now.
our air forces have been destroyed. Our major military bases and cities as well. We have made the decision to nuke the aliens. It is our last hope to survive this horrific attack on Earth. All nuclear armed nations have agreed, it is our only last hope. God help us all. So the Federation have arrived to save the humans and Dragasi fleet. Have all fighter droid ships return to base and activate the jump gate, set course for planet Dragos, I will use my planet destroyer weapon and destroy it once and for all. I will have use for this planet Earth soon. Commander Summus, we must greet the Earthlings now. We must explain all to them that has occurred and what we will do for them given the circumstances. Yes. You are right your highness. I am saddened that we were the cause of their situation and attack on their world by the beast of Harmala. Shall we proceed your highness? Commander, we are preparing the jump gate activation, sir. Countdown begins in 30 minutes. Ship to ship comms online sir. Attention all humans. I am Zarazat, the High Council representative of the Dragazi Species and Federation Alliance. It is with heartfelt sympathy that we share with you for your losses. We had no way to know that the Beast of Harmala had followed us to Earth. He has declared war on all of us. 
As Earth has been made unlivable for you, we are taking you with us to our home, planet Dragos until we can locate a suitable planet for you to live on. We are truly saddened by our losses. We will enter the jump gate in 30 minutes. We have all of your injured being taken care of in our sick bays and have made arrangements for your well-being while aboard out ships and on arrival of planet Dragos as well. Please feel welcome and know that we will do everything we can for your comfort and well-being. You are free to walk around and have a look at our ships while in transfer through the jump gate. Your questions will be addressed on arrival. Commander, we have confirmation that all nuclear warheads have been safely contained aboard, we are clear for departure, sir. Very well, set course for planet Dragos. That may be where the beast of Permala is headed. We must stop him at all costs. Commander, 30 seconds to jump gate activation. the Dragasi have been eliminated. Their planet is no more and their species wiped out except for those on the ships and soon they too will meet their fate. Set course for home base. We will be moving our base of operations to a new location that they would never expect or locate. We will disguise and upgrade our ships and weapon systems. The Federation will have no chance to survive with their leaders all dead. I will assume power and rule the entire universe. We have been contacted by the Federation High Council, Planet Dragos has been destroyed and all lives lost. We have been rerouted to Planet Sequas. That will be the temporary home for the Dragasi and human species survivors until a new world is located for a new home planet. We are saddened by this but we must alert all of our species and the humans as well. Make the announcement on your ships and take course to Planet Sequas. I still cannot believe all of this is true and really happening. Yes, it is nothing like anyone had envisioned. I guess we have much to learn and do now to start over. What are those pods? The pods are for body regeneration. They repair most injuries for biological beings. After death too? No, that is not possible. So, people can live a thousand years? Yes. I am scared but yet relieved that we will survive. This ship is like a city, so big and it has everything we need to survive. Me too, it is scary but we will survive thanks to the Dragazi and Federation. I will miss Earth but now we have a chance to do things right and start over. It is up to us all now, together as the only survivors. This is amazing guys. I can't believe that we are on a spaceship headed for another planet. It is amazing, very cool. Do they have pizza? I am starved. We do have a food replicator for your meals, as you wish. We have finished the tour now so we can go to the galley if you wish it. Yes, I for one would like that, thank you. This is our engineering bay. Have a look around. If you have any questions please ask. 
What powers the ship? I am afraid that that is beyond your ability to understand at the moment but in time you will learn these things. This is all amazing to say the least. Is there a way to travel faster than the speed of light? No, we travel through portals or wormholes but not through time. Hello, we are the Dragazi species. Are you in need of anything? We are happy that you are here with us but not under the circumstances. We are truly saddened. We are grateful to all of you for your assistance and we too are sad that we have lost so many people and our home too. You also have lost much and we are sad it even happened. What do you guys do for entertainment? We are social and enjoy each other's company. Wow you guys are cool looking. Is that your real skin color? Thank you, our green skin is a biological suit. Our real skin is very similar to yours. It is like a uniform. May I ask how your species reproduces? We reproduce the same as you do. Our females bear our children same as you. So you cannot travel through time? No we cannot as it is against our accepted values of life itself. Would it change anything if you could? That is not known to us. We have decided not to attempt it for that very reason. The Federation Alliance seems very together in structure and collective ways for the betterment of all life forms in the universe. Yes, we are but separate species too. I like that. We are arriving at Planet Sequas. We will be transferring all of you to the surface areas set up for you soon. Please wait until your name is called to enter the surface transports. We would like to announce that we have located and explored a new planet suitable for both the Dragazi and human survivors. As both species have agreed to live together as one, the cities will be built accordingly. You have time to choose a new name for your new home planet. We will keep you informed on the progress of construction and date of habitation. You may observe the planet and the location for the cities as well. Anytime on your view screens. We are pleased to announce the relocation to your new planet Kinta as you have named it. The flights are ready for boarding as pre-designated. We trust that you will enjoy your new home world and lives. The interaction of human and the Dragazi species is a first in the universe and will be a model to all species. The humans have learned our ways and become an intricate part of the Federation Alliance forces and teams. 
we welcome them to the Federation. the new combat suit. I am glad and it is better protection for you too. How long will it take to make enough for all the troops left? About 6 months if all goes well. Good, that will give us much needed protection when we need it. I will have everything ready for production in 2 days. Awesome doc, thanks. Incoming message from Federation Alliance, sir. Your Highness Osiris, I have sad news, sir. A rogue black hole has totally destroyed planet Harmala. There were no survivors. We were helpless to evacuate. Please return to the Alliance headquarters immediately. Computer, land on the nearest planet. I must think. What is this? It does not appear to belong here. Is it safe to enter? My sensors indicate that the structure is not from this world and that it is safe. There is no activity or indications of any active devices, your lordship.
had to fall back to the main facility. We fear that there may be thousands of the alien forces. I see. It appears we must surrender. We have no way to fight them, they will kill us all if we do not. Sir, if we surrender we may be killed anyway. The president is right, our only hope is to surrender and hope for the best. Commander, make contact and arrange a meeting with their leader. God help us, yes sir. You can surrender or die. What will you have us do, now? You will all, assist me. And when you depart earth, I will allow you to live. And I am supposed to trust you. Yes. It seems we have no choice. True commander, do it or all of you will die now. You are the last humans alive so be smart and cooperate if you want your species to survive at all, commander. Very well we agree. Collect all of the humans together, I will need their help before we kill them all. The droid ships are arriving now. Put all of them together and find the scientists. I want them brought to the main room. Take the others to a holding area. Notify me when completed. We have completed our mission here it is time to depart. Kill all of the humans and I will personally kill the president. Yes sir. Thank you but we no longer require your services. Goodbye humans. from help. All of your people are already dead and now it is your turn. Goodbye Mr. President of Earth. You humans are such foolish beings. I read the universe of you. We believe that the beast of Hamada is planning an attack on the Federation soon. It appears that he had relocated his hideout on Earth 100 years ago. So he returns. Can't he be stopped? The beast has rebuilt his army of droids, ships and weapons. We have devised a plan to catch him. But can we ever stop his wrath on the Federation? How can we kill an immortal? We are very close to a solution now. Commander, do you believe that after 100 years the beast of Hamada will still attack us? If he does he will be in for a huge surprise won't he? We are now prepared better than ever. With our new systems and weapons we will easily defeat him and be rid of his wrath. Our ancestors were not able to stop him no matter what they did and he always escaped to fight another day. It seems that his immortality has its benefits. Sensors have detected an anomaly nearby in the cloaked fighter ship. It may be a spy ship for the beast of Hamada. The ship is an unknown type and has no official designation or known origin. The ship is within range to beam the droids aboard for investigation. Very well, beam the droid aboard and proceed with scanning their ship. We have captured the droids from the beast of Hamada spy ship. The investigation reveals his entire plan of attack. We must prepare immediately to intercept him. It appears he has a secret unknown method of attack against the Federation headquarters. We must intercept that cargo ship. We also know where his personal ship will exit a wormhole and we will be there to capture him. Generation point and activating the portal generator. The planet 
master laser is ready to fire. Excellent. Fire the laser and totally destroy the Earth. Laser activated. Fire the laser. Zyros has been safely relocated now and we are in position to destroy the cargo ship carrying the explosive device. The beast of Hamala will be totally surprised when he finds all of his plans have gone wrong. Okay, there is the cargo ship. Fire lasers. Good it is done. Let us now set course for interception and capture the beast. Let us end this madness today. Osiris, we have finally ended your wrath upon us. You will never harm us again. We will take you back for trial by the Federation Alliance for your crimes. We will see that you are indeed prosecuted to the full extent of our laws. You have indeed become an immortal beast of evil and now we have a way to convert you back to a human state before your execution. The Federation Alliance has captured the beast of Harmana. We need him if we want to overthrow the Alliance. Send out the spies and prepare the secret base on our asteroid. We will rescue the beast as soon as it is possible. We must find a way. Our secret device to shut down the electrical security systems at the prison holding the beast of Harmala is ready. Our rescue plans have been put in motion and we are ready to act. After 10 years our goal will be reached very soon and we can proceed with our future plans for the destruction of the Federation Alliance. We must be very alert to not be captured or identified or we will all be killed by the Federation. As soon as we retrieve the beast of Harmala, we will head for the asteroid base. Okay, time to dock with the cargo ship. Hidden inside, we will not be detected coming or leaving the prison area.
Osiris, we have come to rescue you. We are the Crucians, pirates if you will. We have a secret hidden base of operations all set up and waiting for you. We must go now quickly. Thank you for your assistance. Osiris, we have the base set up inside an asteroid that is totally undetectable by the Federation Alliance forces. Everything has been set up and is ready for ship and weapons manufacture. Our security and spies are actively monitoring the Federation activity and radio communications. Excellent. I will make contact with my droid army and we can proceed. Soon I will rule the entire universe. The Beast of Harmala may be an immortal being but how many times has he failed to defeat the Federation? Now he has us in his service, what if he fails? Okay, he is kind of cute. <laughs> you are kidding? Well, he is? No, if he succeeds I would be his queen and rule with him over the entire universe. We must also consider the possibility that he is using us and will kill us as he has many others. Welcome to your new secret base Osiris. Behind this protected shield is the work area. It has been prepared for you. We have also provided needed security for your protection and safety. Thank you for rescuing me and all that you have and are doing. Together we will defeat the Federation and I will finally rule the entire universe with you at my side as in forces. No one will have a chance to fight us. Your Highness, the Beast of Harmada has escaped. A group of pirates has assisted him by using an unknown device. There is no trace of them. All units have been placed on the highest alert. Commander, notify the bounty hunters and we will place the highest reward ever for his capture. When he is located use the immediate device and kill him immediately. The pirates will all be executed as well and their entire species for this act. What are these readings coming from that asteroid? I am getting an abnormal reading of the thermal and magnetic flux. Perhaps we should investigate. This is an inside it hailing the ship exiting the asteroid. Do you read? Over. We read you Nasidica. We are Crucians and had a small problem with our ship's systems and had to take refuge on the asteroid to fix it. All is okay now. Thank you for your contact. Nasidica clear and departing asteroid field. We will return after the Crucians have departed and check on these readings. Something is very strange about this. I have heard rumors that some Crucians are secretly pirates and they may be the ones that helped the beast escape and are hiding him.
send to the cavern and take more scans. We may learn more. Let's also leave a probe behind to monitor any future activity. Bounty Hunter Calling Federation Headquarters. We have encountered some strange events on an asteroid in the Asica asteroid field. We will be landing on the asteroid Cetase so to monitor any activity. We have placed a probe in a cavern for observation. We will be cloaked and will monitor this channel. Nezadik at the Federation, we have docked on the asteroid and are beginning our scans and observations. Out. We have detected much activity by the Crucian ships. We believe the beast of Harmala is hidden here. We have also devised a plan to enter and beam him aboard our ship. It will be risky but we believe possible. We can head for your closest ship but will need assistance quickly as they will pursue us. Federation to Nezadik. We will move our armada in range but not too close as to be detected. If you are successful we will protect you. Nezadik to Federation, we are beginning our recovery of the beast. Please move your ships in now. Federation to Nezadik, we are in position now and standing by. board my ship on the asteroid and kill that bounty hunter immediately. I will escape into a wormhole and make contact when I am safe. Yes sir, stand by transporting to your ship now sir. Nezay Dick at the Federation, we have the beast on board and are headed your direction hot. They are right behind us and closing. Oh no, they have beamed him onto one of their ships and are firing on us. Please help us. We have the bounty hunter and his crew safely aboard. We have also intercepted a message that the beast has boarded his ship to flee into a wormhole. The Amegic device has been activated and we can initiate the kill shot from here as he enters the wormhole, sir. Excellent. Proceed, Commander. At last we will be rid of the beast forever. Our new device will kill the beast and rid us of his wrath once and for all. Fire the immediate device on my mark. Fire.
activated the body of the beast. He is dead. His droids are also deactivated. We have succeeded, sir. It is confirmed. The beast is finally dead. The Amegic device has worked. It is finally over your highness. Commander, notify Federation headquarters. Place a tractor beam on his ship and we will tow it back with us to the command port. We will place the body of the beast on display for the entire universe to see and have a grand celebration throughout the entire universe. Yes sir, with pleasure. Today is a great day in the universe. We celebrate the death of the beast of Harmala. A new peace has come to the universe. We also honor our bounty hunter Axis and his crew for their assistance in capturing the beast. Their dedication to the Federation and its peoples is beyond outstanding. As a result we have offered him a position as Admiral. His crew will also serve under him in appropriate positions. Let the celebration begin.